Hello, Leo. It's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Leo with the clear, concise message from you. All right, let's see. So everybody wants to know about love. Let's see what's going on for love for Leo, okay? Could be dealing with a Piscean, a Piscean person. Um, I don't know, is this like a heavy argument? This person is kind of, oh, so they're coming in sideways. Maybe they're sidestepping you. They're not telling you exactly how they feel. Um, you don't know where they stand. Uh, things can be kind of, you know, um, hands off, or maybe you guys are not having sex, or there's something coming in between the two of you. What's happening here? Yeah, Queen of Queen of Wands. I don't know if this is another person. Uh, something about sex, because the Queen of Wands talks about sex. She's the only queen with her legs open, if you will. Um, this could be you, uh, Leo. Let's see. Um, you want to know something? Yeah, Nine of Pentacles. This could be something about new business or something like that, or um, defeat sideways. Um, maybe you feel like you don't know if you should bring something up. Six of Pentacles, maybe something about money, ownership, or a partnership, or not enough. Something is not enough. Ace of Wands, we got a lot of cards about doing something. So somebody started something, they're doing it solo, but at the same time, you're involved. If somebody wants to know something about partnership, um, they want something to be fair and balanced. Either you do or they do. Ten of Wands, you just don't want to be doing something and you don't know where it's, it could end up. And then you don't have your ducks in a row or things aren't written out on paper or you're not ownership, you have ownership of this could even be in terms of marriage. Yeah. Eight of wands, things could be taken off something maybe online, king of swords and the knight of cups. It's like, um, maybe somebody's becoming their own boss or, um, ambitious or ambition or something, doing something, a creative endeavor. The two of wands, it looks like somebody's finding financial security between two different things that they're doing, but it's more so somebody wants to know where's this relationship going. This could be same sex. We got two, a king and an emperor here. Um, with the strength card, yeah, somebody other per, other people's money. Somebody could be counting other people's money or somebody wants, you know, what other people have or looking at something in terms of online or trying to count something or trying to take credit for or take, yeah, take something in account. Somebody wants credit for something. What is this about uh, for Leo? abundance yes yeah, about money keeping a positive mindset somebody's getting a lot photograph looking at photos missing you nostalgia making new memories so somebody's like um maybe somebody wants to come back from the past also uh let's see keep keys on a ring many options decision unconventional string along yeah that's what i was getting like somebody wants to like are we getting married are we going to be together are we business partners something about somebody doesn't want to be strung along here keys on a ring here let's see and then yeah stabbed in the back it's like heartbreak pain separation a shocking attack like somebody's like i just don't want things to fall apart and i don't have me in order yeah not enough frustrated in a relationship lack of confidence maybe fear and ego healthy choices yeah somebody's like look it, i just need to protect me and what I'm bringing to the table in terms of a relationship and or business. Um, and I just need to make sure that I'm solidified here. Let's see what else is going on. What's the advice for Leo advice for Leo. Eight of wands. You need to have a conversation. It, this talks about, um, you know, stating your intentions. You know, you want to know what somebody intends to do and you want to state yours too. Yeah because somebody could be maybe selfish overly ambitious will do anything leaving you out 
Yeah, in terms of money. You got a lot of money cards coming out in terms of something turning really good or, you know, um, yeah, nine of pentacles again. So it's like you want to know. you it's, it's that stand your ground and demand whatever it is you feel like you deserve from this boss or this emperor. Um, it could be a boss at work or something like that. Um, somebody's overly ambitious using you or what you bring to the table but not paying you enough, not enough, holding on to. So um, you need to speak your peace or forever hold it, right? Um, this is what I have for you. If it resonates for you, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. Go over to the website book there. Ask question um, via text message also. Um, the number is below. You can catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And don't forget, if this resonates with you, go book your own personal reading. Thank you. Many blessings to you. Take care.